Hey guys, I want to show you real quick how we use Hootsuite for our Twitter account. So I'm going to share my screen and let me go into Hootsuite. So Hootsuite is free up to three social media platforms. They just announced on um, come August 1st, they're not going to be posting to Facebook personal profiles anymore, but that doesn't really matter. We usually use Buffer for our scheduling tool um, for Facebook. The reason I love Hootsuite, Hootsuite works really great with Instagram too if you're scheduling your posts, but I love Hootsuite for Twitter. And the reason why is you can use Buffer to schedule your tweets to go out, but Hootsuite, I just, for me, it's more visually appealing and I like how it's organized with these things that are called streams. So you connect your Twitter account and then you set up these streams. And what we have set up here is our mentions. So anytime somebody mentions at social speak, um, or our handle is at social speak or social underscore speak. But anytime that they, they mention us, um, then we get, you know, a notification. So then we can make sure that we are either liking that post or commenting on that, um, making sure that we're staying engaged with our audience. The second stream that we have is your direct messages. So I love Twitter on my phone because I think it's it's easy to be able to use, but sometimes it gets a little chaotic, which is so many things going on. So for us, mm -hmm. I like to just be able to jump on here and I can see everything in one easy platform. So it keeps track of your inbox. Um, so you can kind of see if anything, I would say 90% even nine, even higher, 95% of your, your inbox is going to be mostly spam or things that really aren't necessarily important. You know, there's going to be just, um, the chat box, the automated replies, the, you know, sell, sell, sell. So unless you're really engaged in Twitter and you're starting to have these conversations with people that will change, um, which we do recommend. So you can set up your inbox. We also then have, you know, my tweets. So these are the tweets that we have put out, whether it's, um, you know, most of our stuff that we're putting onto Twitter is a lot of just social media, digital marketing tips and tricks. We do a lot of retweeting, which is what this means here, retweet. And um, so you can see all of the posts that are going out. Then I have, and this is where I really love, um, Hootsuite and I this makes that retweeting process and mentions process a lot easier so you can set up different search streams for different hashtags so what I do is like this one is you can see it's not necessarily a hashtag because there's there, it's not a hashtag because there's spaces between the words but anyone that's talking about social media marketing is going to come right into the stream so I can, you know, look at this and I can say, oh, okay, this is, this is great. I love this post. And I can click either just retweet it to retweet as it is, or I can click this and I can click quote or edit. So let's say I want to click edit. Then I can say, you know, this is obviously a longer tweet. So I, I because of this part here, that's why I'm over that, that negative 44. So it tells you on that 240 or 280 character, or excuse me, 280 character um, freedom that you have to use, characters you have to use, then it's gonna tell you if you're negative or not. So let's clear that one. And then let's look at um, how to market on Reddit. So let's say I wanna quote this one, I could click edit. And I could say something along the lines of, this is why we love Reddit, great blog, or whatever it may be. So you can type in your own message to go along with that tweet. So it makes it easy to just be able to retweet something or just to like something. Um, then we have, you know, our other hashtags that are actual hashtags, internet marketing, online strategy, 
social media today, social media. Um, so this I can go through here and it makes it just super easy for us to go through, retweet, like, comment, you know, whatever it may be. But I love this platform. And then also gives you the option to, you know, show you your scheduled tweets so you know what's going out. Um, we also have a, um, oops, that's not what I want to do. Um, I don't know why we have this search, but if we, you know, we, we could keep it on there or if you don't want it, you can just click delete. Then if you want to add another one, you can add like home, which is going to be your home feed. So you can see all the people that you are actually following, um, that are tweeting. So you make sure that you can, you know, stay on top of the people that you are already interacting with. You can also, um, the lists, if people put you in lists or the lists you have, you can monitor your likes, your outbox. So you have your inbox and your outbox. And then this is to add one of those keywords. You can type in here, um, let's do freelance, freelance business owner. Let's see what is searching on that. So there's nothing, if it says no content, that usually means that nobody is using that. So then go ahead and delete that. Come back to your search freelance and let's just type. And there's a ton of stuff that people are, are tweeting on freelance. So that is why I love Hootsuite for Twitter. It's just an easy visual platform. Sometimes when I go to Twitter on my phone or even, you know, the computer I'm on here now, and I, sometimes it's just overwhelming for me. I don't know why it just, it is. Um, here is in a little bit ago or earlier in the, in the email, I talked about the search. So I love how Twitter has their search. It shows you, you know, who to follow people. You can look at, um, the latest, post that has used that, that, um, hashtag that you are looking for people, photos, videos, news, broadcast. This is why, you know, this, their Twitter search is great. So I highly recommend setting up a free Hootsuite account just for your Twitter. It will really make your life a lot easier. Um, if you have questions on that, you know, let us know and we can help you get that set up. But that's one tool that works really well with Twitter. Thank you.